Good evening, it's JT Walters, Indian River County Fluid Artist. We're going to do something with um, flash uh, color shift paintings, paint. So let me go through this real quick with you. I put the paint on to save some time so that you guys don't have to sit and watch me mix them up and pour. Um, it's really simple. Where it's red, it's splash red. Where it, it looks, this right here looks purple, but it's not. It's actually considered flash blue. That's splash green. That splash pink. It's not rocket scientist, guys. I'm gonna add a little bit of gold in here. And I mean, if you're looking at this going, wow, a blind man could do this, you're right. That's when people tell me they can't paint. I'm like, everybody can paint. It's just a matter of trying. And so, um, I really don't have a plan, obviously, but I know my paint viscosity and I know my paint chemistry. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a swipe. And we're going to try and see if I can swipe it down black all the way down through these different colors and see if it makes a nice color shift. What's really cool about color shift paints, um, if you've never worked with them, is they're iridescent. Yes, the glasses fall off all the time in the paint, if you're wondering that too. So that, that's something to watch for in my paintings, because that's, you know, in my videos, because that's pretty hysterical when that happens. Even I have to laugh at that one. So we're putting black up here at the end, the top, just getting a good coverage. And, oh gosh, don't tip over. And then I'm gonna take my swiper. Let me put some black in the middle in case we run out. You know, and you're thinking way too much paint, probably but I want to swipe. So the key to swiping is not to go too heavy and just let, just pull the black down through. So all you're really trying to do here is get all this black down. You can hold on a little bit heavier as you slide further down. Okay, and that side's gonna be wiped. Right here. And then I go back and I do this side. Oops. Yep, I'm gonna have to go for no, I'm gonna go with a different tool. Go with a smaller tool. And you'll just see I'm just swiping and pulling the color down through the other colors. Got a few errors already on here I can see I'm gonna have to fix which really isn't that big of a deal. But like that right there, that's gotta come out. So I come back in with cards and I see if I can swipe further up and then back down to see if I can bring it see further down into the the painting. I may have to add some black to that. I may not. I may get lucky. And you just swipe further down here. Whoops. Light, 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 light. Touch. Over here. And then you let the cells come up. It's basically it. Right now I'm going to wait for the cells and see if I get some better cells coming up. I can go back and put some over here, get that a little bit right here, and swipe down with that, just with a regular old, it's one of the paint cards you get at the paint store, just grab it, freebie, you know, freebie tool to paint with, put it aside. That's it. Now I've got my torch and it was very ugly because I ran out of fuel um, the other day when I was torching in the middle of a painting and th that's why I'm painting over this one is because it got basically my my fuel, my butane was gone. Which a girl and a butane should never be parted. Okay, so now, 
I'll let that sit for a second. And I'm going to get the black paint off the ground because that's not good. Pick up a little bit. You'll always spill. Black goes everywhere, so you'll notice it first. You always spill a little more than you hope. So, this is uh, no plan. And it looks it. and maybe I can't really is a I don't freaking know you just try I mean that's basically it with art anyways is you're just trying you never can guarantee an outcome right now my leg has a wound and I just had surgery so I'm kind of just muddling around in the paint so anyways now i'm going to torch it guys so let me turn on my my flame and i want to hit the stuff up here first because this is probably going to be the most interesting stuff that comes up A little bit darker than I would have liked it. But given I have that smooge over here, I gotta do something with that smooge. It's really bothering me. The smooge has to go. I don't know how I'm going to get rid of it quite yet, but it's got to go. Fine with that. I'd rather have that than the one I had before. Okay. So you just, you're basically breaking up the air bubbles. And this is in a pizza box on the ground. I don't really have a table set up for this. But this is it. My real thing that I would tell you is, is don't cut your canvas on fire. That's, that's a stinker. I have a video on how to repair those, but it is a stinker when you do it. So that's it. It's no real big deal here. Still not wild about this side. I really am not. Shut. Yeah, no, I think I'm gonna make it worse, but this is where you get to the point where you you have to make a decision not to overmodel. And I tend never to make that decision. I just tend to go for it, because I'm like, it's a canvas. Worst case scenario is I'll overpaint, I'll paint over it. Okay, I'm not crazy about that part, I'm gonna do something about it. But fortunately you won't see it, so whatever I end up doing, I'll post this later. This is Indian River County Fluid Artist, Fluid Artist JT Walters. I'm out of breath because I gotta stand over with a bad back too. I'm on a bad leg doing this, so it's not exactly easy, but um, worth the end product, except for that one little part that I really hate. I'll probably shift it off because I can move the paint still. And uh, this is doing a swipe with shift colors. Great thing about this painting is, is when you turn it, it changes colors. So I'm going to let you go. I hope you have a wonderful evening. And I hope you enjoy this video. And thank God it didn't land in the trash. I mean, in the paint. <laughs>